It was business as usual Monday for the Ukrainian president, but he did mention on his Telegram page that he was briefed on the struggle against traitors in Ukraine. The country's security service spokesperson says on the eve of a visit to the Mykolaiv region, a Russian informant was trying to collect intelligence on the president. These images are from Vladimir Zelensky's visit to Mykolaiv last month, but it's not clear if this was the trip the alleged Russian operative was using to learn the locations, times and routes the president would be traveling. Officials shared this obscured image of the woman in question, but did not release her name. They were tipped off about her and launched additional security measures, including counter-surveillance. Plots against Zelensky are not new. The secretary of the National Security Defense Council told Global News last year that on four occasions he had to tell the president about possible assassination attempts. His reaction is annoyed. Oh, again, he says, but I have to tell him. It's not known how many more attempts there have been since that interview, but the president travels a lot more now and is more visible compared to the early days of Russia's full invasion. What hasn't changed is the toll the war is taking on families. Ukrainian officials say one woman died when Russia hit this building in the Kherson region early Monday. Ukraine, as a part of its counteroffensive, is fighting to reclaim recently lost territory and long-occupied regions like Crimea. On Sunday, it hit two bridges in that area, including the Chonar Road Bridge. Rob Hubert is a military strategist. Because, because you have this so, this so overlap between the political and military means, I see this particular element of the war intensifying. This is where there's going to be some very increasing fighting because the stakes are so important for both sides. With the push to reclaim territory and the foiled assassination attempt, the updating of the motherland statue in Kyiv with the Ukrainian trident serves as a larger-than-life reminder of the need for defense, but also victory. Crystal Gamansing, Global News, London.